Well, hello and welcome to the Hellqvist Hammond Hour, coming to you from Uppsala, Sweden. And it's 6 o'clock here in, uh, in the evening. It's 9 o'clock in California, in the west coast of the US. Noon on the east coast. And uh, uh, about uh, uh, 1 o'clock in Australia, I think. I'm just going to get my uh, chat here up on the screen and also the song list. Okay, uh, hello Ryan, already on pl in place. Uh, and uh, Harley, hello. Uh, and Bob, of course. Okay, our co-host uh, Toby Simmons uh, from Encino, California, will I think not be joining us today. But we have an acting co-host, if I understand correctly, in Terry Linder. So let's see if he, she uh, uh, if she shows up soon here. Uh, and Tim, of course, in Minneapolis. Okay, I'll continue with my uh, new uh, approach and start playing as soon as possible. And I'll talk some more later. Uh, as you know. It's uh, this stream will be a lot about uh, peace and love uh, because of the awful things that are, are going on in the world right now. So I thought I'd start with a Swedish song uh, with a, a singer called Doris. Uh, she uh, did a couple of albums in the uh, late 60s, real good ones. And uh, uh, this one, uh, I think you might have heard uh, all. It's called... Uh, did you give the world some love today? And uh, always a relevant question, I would say. So, did you give some love? Did you give the world some love today? Thank you. 
Yes, that was Doris, Doris, uh, Swedish singer, uh, and uh, check her out if you haven't heard her. She he has actually some great records, and it had, has this uh, late 60s vibe that I love. And I actually, that, that'll be kind of the theme today, I think, also, because I, I kind of uh, looked up a little Woodstock things, and uh, I thought about this peace and love uh, uh, theme. So it'll be uh, a lot of music from that period uh, today, and that, uh, that feels nice, that feels groovy. Uh, I, as I guess they would have said back then. Okay. Uh, as you know, there is a tip jar, and you have information about it uh, at the, that end of the screen. Uh, so if you uh, have the means, please consider making a donation, either through Switch in Sweden or uh, PayPal if you're abroad. And uh, please tell me where you're watching. Uh, I see uh, the usual, uh, my, uh, the, the family has already checked in, but all, to all you others, do drop a line. Uh, really nice to know uh, how, how far we're spreading ac across the globe. Uh, so, yeah. Now, I thought I'd uh, keep going with this uh, love theme. And... Uh, uh, and of course, uh, one, one song that you like can't miss in, when, when you're doing that, uh, I'll play Beatles' uh, All You Need Is Love. So that'll be the next tune, All You Need Is Love. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, yes, what a nice song. Uh, uplifting, and uh, yeah, let's. So yeah, let's see some. Uh, say, let's see. Uh, let's see so, uh, a lot of heart and peace, peace emojis today. Uh, I think we all need it, and uh, yeah. Uh, so I'm. Um, let's see. Okay. Uh, so that was uh, some love, love songs about love to 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 start off the evening. Uh, I thought also I uh, I re I got to think of this uh, uh, a Grant Green record that I used to listen to, and uh, because uh, bombs are falling and that's horrible, uh, it has to stop. And uh, so I, and I remembered a tune by Grant Green called. Uh, Seize the bombing, and I, I'm guessing it's it's more about what happened in the uh, in the 60s, perhaps in Vietnam or something, but relevant still today. Uh, so seize seize the bombing, and uh, goes like this.
Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, uh, Charles from South Africa. Nice. Um, yes, great. I, I really like the vibe in that song. And for, yes, I, I, I think I, I, I try to present the songs, uh, but I'd be glad to repeat the title. It's called Seize the Bombing. Seize the Bombing. Uh, and I don't really know the origin. I don't think Grant Green is the composer, uh, but I heard a recording that he did uh, with that. But yeah, but it's available on, on uh, you can find it on Spotify and, and, and uh, uh, the streaming service. I, so, so you can, but cease, cease the bombing. Uh, okay, yeah, I mean, that, that's uh, nice. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, and whether it has lyrics, I don't know. I don't know. It wouldn't surprise me, but I haven't, I haven't heard it, so I, that's, yeah. Okay, and we, we got one in the comments also, so you can see the title in writing as well there. Okay, great. Now, uh, I think I'll go a little, even a little deeper into the, the this, uh, how to call it, the... Uh, uh, yeah, I know the word, but anyway, I was listening to, like I was checking the old Woodstock videos and the bands that played, and, and, I, was, uh, and I was listening to this uh, Joni Mitchell song, Woodstock, and uh, uh, beautiful song, and there's two versions, like there's the way she does it, and then uh, Crosby, Stills and Nash uh, has their version, and uh, I was a little uh, hesitant w which version to, to pick, but I think I went with the uh, with the Joni Mitchell. It's kind of more uh, it's more delicate, and uh, yeah, I thought it it'll, it would suit the vibe as well. And uh, also, Larry Goldings has recorded a great version of this on, on his trio record Moonbird. So uh, highly recommend that. But yeah, I thought I'd play the song Woodstock, so I'll continue with this uh, kind of experimental, progressive, uh, uh, rockish uh, mood. Uh, here is Woodstock.
Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, that was a great song to to uh, to get to know and get to you know. It's 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 the kind of song that you have to like spend time with and be with, <laughs> uh, and it's just this uh, uh, really nice. Uh, yeah, that you you find yourself in a really interesting place when you when you play it. Uh, so that's yeah, I, I really like it. Um, first time I played it today. Uh, okay, so uh, uh, now also I made a promise for today. I think it's it's time for. Oh yes, it is. Okay, so I made a promise to do some Procol Harum, and I'm a man of my word. Uh, so I'm gonna do some Procol Harum. I'm actually gonna sing some Procol Harum. So uh, that'll be exciting. I got two songs, and uh, the first one you can guess, I'm sure. The other one, not so sure. But the, I think I'll start with the obvious, and uh, yeah, to just play a wider shade of play. And for to do that, now I have to adjust the reverb. I have a special reverb, reverb uh, prepared. Now you hear a whole other echo, but that's just to for the uh, singing vocals, okay. Um, and then I need the lyrics, so let's get that. And here we go. Cause the floor I was feeling kind of seasick But the crowd called out for more And the room was humming harder As the ceiling flew away When we called out for another drink the waiter bought a tray And so it was that later As the miller told his tale That her face at first just ghostly Turn a wider shade of pale She said there is no reason And the truth is plain to see But I wandered through my playing card Would not let her be One of six investal virgins Who were leaving for the cold and although my eyes were open, they might as well be closed. And so it was that later, as the miller told his tale, turn the face at first just ghostly to a wider 
shade of prayer when so it was that later when the miller told his tale that her face at first just ghostly turn a wider shade of pale Okay, and Toby, you made it. So nice to see you. Uh, okay, so that was the first, Whiter Shade of Pale. Uh, now, for the other one, uh, okay, so I re just realized I... Uh, wait, I have to, yes. Oh, yes, yeah, sorry, <laughs> I know where I can find the lyrics. Okay, uh, so for the other one, uh, it was that just... I don't know, maybe 10, 15 years ago or something, but it was the time before the streaming services ha had uh, like started dominating the, the how you, you consume music. And it was that time that you still, maybe you still didn't do mixtapes, but you did, you could do mix CDs. So you would, so I had a friend, uh, a drummer friend, uh, who, um, uh, he made a mix CD for me with his favorite organ music and uh, and he included a, a, a couple of uh, Procol Harum songs and let's say I, I would I would think this was probably 15 years ago or something maybe for, uh, more than 10 years anyway and I remembered the song I had no I had no idea what the title was but I I remembered the song and I thought wow if I could find if I could find that song uh, I would really like to play it. So, uh, so I started looking around, and here's the when you're you're happy about all the streaming services because you can just you know browse browse through the whole uh, 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 the whole uh, catalog of, of Procol Harum, and uh, uh, and eventually I don't know how many songs I just. You know, you listen a few seconds because I would recognize it immediately. And so I would listen a few seconds and I know not that one, not that one, not that one, not that one. And then suddenly, bow, there it is. Uh, so, and it turns out that this, uh, this song is uh, called Quite Rightly So. Now, let's see, I'm going to just read a few comments. Okay. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. I, I wish I could say. Uh, well, uh, I, I, I would. I will. I will put it like this. I envy those of you who were young in the '60s. I would have liked to experience that time, uh, but well, we all have. We all have our own time, I guess. So you just have to ha be happy to by, about the time uh, you were born into. But. Yeah, so many things about the, the 60s and 70s that, that uh, I would have liked to have seen with my own eyes. Uh, but yeah, so anyway, this, here's the song uh, called Quite Rightly So. I'm so in need of saving grace 
be kind to you, my me. I'm lost amidst the sea of wheat, where people speak, but seldom meet. And grief and laughter, strange but true. Although they die, they seldom cry. I know with any other name I know my dream of sweet Perhaps the sun will never shine Upon my field of wheat But still in closing let me say For those too sick to sick to see, though not it shows, yes, someone knows. I wish the one was me. But still in closing, let me say Love those too sick, too sick to see Oh, not it shows, yes, someone knows I wish that one was me Oh, not it shows, yes, someone knows that that someone was me Though not it shows Yeah, well, I know I wish that someone was me Okay, and now, okay, now I have to remember to turn off the singing reverb. Let's see, like that. Okay. Uh, okay, so that was one of the uh, one of the challenges for this week, and uh, happy to do it. These are songs I really like. Uh, happy to share them with you, and uh, yeah. Now, let's, I'm going to cool things down a little, uh, but just temporarily. Uh, but uh, I remember also McCoy Tyner, a uh, jazz ballad, a really nice one, I think from his record, The Real McCoy, and it's called Search for Peace. So I thought that that would be a nice song for today as well. Search for Peace.
Okay, so uh, just reading uh, some of the comments. Uh, hello, Angel from Alabama. The Angel from Alabama. Uh, nice to have you here. Uh, let's see. Just going to... Uh, and... Uh, Neil Van Erd from New York. Hello. Uh, hello to you. So nice to see you. And uh, thank you all for uh, all others. Yes. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, I have a couple of tunes left. And the, this next one is that was kind of this week's big challenge, I would say. Uh, because uh, when I. Uh, when I was, like the themes was uh, peace and love and freedom and stuff, and, and I was watching Woodstock and I was playing the Woodstock song. Uh, and, and then I thought, wow, it would be really nice to do something by Jimi Hendrix. I haven't done that. Uh, and uh, yeah, so the question is what to do. And he has a song called Freedom, and uh, I, I listened to it and I, I thought, well, maybe, maybe. I've been working on it, and uh, I'm going to try it. So I'm going to play Freedom by Jimi Hendrix in just to, to, to honor freedom. And uh, yeah, here it is. Thank you. 
Okay, almost. <laughs> That's a fun, fun song. I think in, I think it, uh, I think it can uh, stay in the repertoire. Always fun, fun to to uh, widen the uh, the range of songs. Okay, uh, we are getting quite close uh, to. Uh, we are getting quite close to. Uh, to the end of the show, but yeah, this is, fits quite nicely. I have two songs left that I uh, thought I'd be doing, so let's just do them. Uh, I'll remind everyone about the tip jar. Please, if you have the means, uh, do uh, make a donation. Uh, also, yes, I want to inform you that uh, next week I will be on tour, but I will try to solve it in some way, uh, maybe like the last week where I did some... Uh, or maybe I'll pre-record something, but I'll, I'll definitely try to arrange some kind of live stream next Saturday at the same time. So uh, stay tuned for that. Also, I want to mention that I this week, earlier this week, I started a pod. And instead of having the band streams that I had earlier, I, I'll be having guests and we'll pre-record some songs and an interview and it'll be available on my YouTube channel. And so the first episode is out now where I have a ped pedal steel guitar player uh, and we play a couple of songs uh, and uh, talk and uh, I think it was really nice and it's in English so uh, for all you Eng uh, uh, so it's not, not, not just limited to Sweden. Uh, so check that out. Uh, the songs will be out, I think, separately. There's only one song out now, Danny Boy. Uh, but that's worth listening, only that as well. Uh, so, And there'll be more. There, I, I'll try to do an episode each week for that as well. So, Okay, but now I thought I'd, I'd be... Uh, I would just be grooving a little. Uh, three, uh, the, the Young Rascals uh, and the, their song, Grooving. So that'll be... Uh, and then I'll be one last. Okay.
yeah. Okay. Thank you, Terry. Uh, okay. Thank you. Thank you so much, Angel and Bob. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. So I, I've I've had a I've had a real groovy hour with you here. I hope you have too. And uh, uh, I hope to see you next week in whatever form it may be. I'll let you know. And uh, I will play my last song will also be for peace. And I would say maybe it's the go-to song when you talk about uh, peace songs. Uh, I thought about the, the John Lennon, Yoko Ono, Give Peace a Chance. But I thought uh, you could do it as a kind of a funk vamp and just let it cook for a while. So yeah, I, I, I'll you know I'll just put on the stove and let it uh, let it cook, and that'll be the end for this hour. And then we'll have uh, and uh, we'll all hope and pray for peace uh, and uh, just uh, be kind and loving to each other. I hope. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for tuning in today.
peace. Okay, that was the Hammond Hour for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I can also tell you that I think next week's guest for the for the pod that uh, for now is called Guest at the HQ uh, will be blues guitarist uh, Thomas Ornesen. He's the one that I was uh, last week when I was out uh, uh, playing. He was the one I played with them, and he's actually him and me have been playing together for 20 years this year. So it's. Uh, Really, we're uh, both uh, old uh, companions and uh, like, or colleagues and uh, friends. And it, so I'm looking forward to to that. I think it'll be out on Wednesday or Thursday, maybe. Okay. Peace and love to everyone. Bye.